Namaste. This is Ali. And this Yoga Nidra is meant to connect you to the wisdom of your subtle body, energetic body or layer, also known as the Prana Maya Kosha. You do not have to know anything about the yogic pranic anatomy for this yoga nidra to be beneficial to you. Begin to settle in to a comfortable position in your body. Take the time to get your legs and hips completely comfortable, relaxing down into the feet making any adjustments for the torso, the spine, the comfort of your chest, and then letting the arms come into a comfortable position, letting the hands soften, arms completely at ease, and noticing if there's any little tiny adjustments you can make for your head, the support of your head, your neck, taking extra care of your physical body to make sure that it can settle completely into deep relaxation, making sure that your head is in a comfortable and neutral alignment. And then begin to let your shoulders soften down and down deep into the ground. Closing down through the eyes. Noticing the support beneath your body knowing that all there is to do is listen to sounds and the guidance of my voice. Allow your practice to be completely effortless. You might come in and out of hearing the words that are flowing, and this is completely okay. Allowing yourself and everything to be just as it is for these moments of your deep rest practice. Begin to sense your whole body, sensing the rhythm of your breath, letting your attention draw deep into the body, sensing the diaphragm rising and falling, sensing the expansion of your lungs and the emptying out, the flow of air within the throat and the nostrils, sensations inside your mouth, jaw, tongue, allowing your ears to open perceiving whatever sounds you can hear in the environment around you, just allowing them to come and go. Taking a deep breath in through the nose, holding momentarily at the top 
when you feel the urge to exhale, feel as though every cell in your body is releasing on the out breath. And let's do that again, deep breath in. Filling all the way up, holding. On the exhale, trillions of cells releasing simultaneously, releasing into the ground. One more time. Holding. When you release, letting layers of tension melt and release. Then let your breath become soft and effortless now. Each breath naturally unfolding. Notice yourself relaxing back into the flow of ever-changing perceptions in the field of open awareness. And you're just kind of relaxing back into that field of open awareness now. Letting your mind completely relax from thinking, analyzing, Opening up to simply feeling, sensing, listening. And we'll welcome a sankalpa for this practice. And you might have your own primary sankalpa that you're working with. Or you might welcome. I trust in the intelligence of life itself and how that intelligence flows through me naturally and effortlessly. Repeating your sankalpa three times now mentally whispering. Could you invite your sankalpa to be everywhere as a felt experience, a felt expression, alive and radiant within you and all around you? And now invite all of your attention to condense as Awareness in the center of the mind's eye, the center of the forehead. You may see it take the form of a brilliant white point of light, or perhaps a violet point of light, and letting attention rotate through the body. And as you do so, you might imagine that you have a magic wand. And this magic wand is placing this point of light just beneath the surface 
of your body, effortlessly landing just behind the center of the forehead, a brilliant point of light. From the center of the forehead to the roof of the mouth, feel the presence of this brilliant white or violet point of light. You might imagine placing it there with your magic wand. The tip of the tongue, a point of luminous light. The center of the throat, placing a point of light. The pit of the throat, the center of the heart, a luminous point of light, continuing in this way, the right shoulder, the elbow, the wrist, the center of the palm, a point of radiant light at all five fingertips, starting with the tip of the thumb. One, two, three, four, five. back to the palm of the hand, magically placing just beneath the surface of the palm, the wrist, the elbow, the shoulder, the right side of the chest, the center of the heart, the left side of the chest, the left shoulder, a point of luminous light, the elbow, the wrist, the center of the palm, the tips of all five fingers, starting at the thumb, one, two, three, four, five, back to the palm of the hand, the wrist, elbow, shoulder, left side of the chest, center of the heart, right side of the chest, back to the center of the heart, a point of luminous radiant light the navel center, a shimmering point of light, the pubic bone, the right hip joint, the knee, ankle, sole of the right foot, all five toes, Starting with the big toe, one, two, three, four, five. Center of the sole of the foot, 
ankle, knee, hip, pubic bone, left hip joint, point of radiant light, knee, ankle, sole of the foot, of each of the toes, one, two, three, four, five, center of the sole of the foot, ankle, knee, hip joint, pubic bone, the tip of the tailbone, a luminous point of light, the sacrum, placing a luminous radiant light in the center of your body, right at the level of your sacrum, moving up towards the solar plexus, placing a brilliant white light in the center of your body at the solar plexus. The heart center placing the light in the center of your chest. The throat center, a luminous point of light in the center of your throat. The mind's eye center, the center of your forehead. Could you imagine placing a brilliant point of light in the center of your brain? The crown of your head, a shimmering point of light. Attention condensing here at the crown of the head, light, brilliant light. As you let your attention rest here. Begin to sense the natural flow of breath within your body, feeling the inhalation and the exhalation with awareness condensed at the crown of the head. And could you imagine pure white light infused with life force energy and the intelligence of life itself above the crown of your head a beam of this brilliant light pouring in from above the crown of your head flowing down through your body towards the soles of your feet. On the inhale, flowing down through your body, directly into your heart. 
the powerhouse of your subtle body, exhaling all the way down to the soles of the feet. Inhaling through crown from above the head down into the heart. Exhaling from heart down through your body into the tips of the toes. Just continuing to breathe in this way, allowing each breath to pour a light into the different channels and energetic rivulets through your whole physical body. You might imagine each inhale light and energy, nurturing and nourishing each of your energetic centers, inhaling to the center of the brain, the mind's eye, exhaling down through the body. Inhaling from crown to throat, nourishing with energy and light, exhaling down through the body. Inhaling from crown to heart. Exhaling down and through the body. Inhaling from crown to solar plexus. Exhaling down through to the toes. Inhaling from crown to sacrum. Exhaling down through the pelvis and legs. Inhaling from crown to the base of the spine. Exhaling down through the legs. Releasing this visualization with your breath and bringing all of your attention to the entire right side of your body. You might imagine you could draw a line through the center of your physical body 
and invite all of your attention to pour into the right side of your body. Becoming alive with sensation, warmth, breath, and energy. You might imagine the left side of your body falling off into darkness or nothingness, and you're breathing light, warmth, and sensation all throughout the whole right side of your body. Feeling and sensing right arm, hand, torso, leg, foot, and toes, whole right side of the face, jaw, eye, scalp, and hair, the entire right side of the body, alive and radiant with sensation. And then giving time for your attention to migrate to the left side of the body. You might imagine the right side of the body falling away into darkness or nothingness. And you're breathing warmth, light, energy into the left side of the body. Whole left side radiant with sensation. Welcoming the left arm and hand, the whole left side of the torso, leg, foot, and toes, all the way into the left side of the face the left side of the jaw, eye, scalp, and hair, the entire left side of the body. Alive, radiant with light, the sensation, warmth. Aliveness. Could you let your attention now come over to the right side of the body, giving time for attention to drop away from the left side and saturate the right side of the body once again. As you welcome the right side of your body, could you begin to welcome also the energetic, magnetic field of your body on the right side? It might feel like a whole right hemisphere of your body, energetic magnetic field of the body is spherical in nature. So you might feel a sense of energy or sensation that radiates out beyond your physical body. You might feel something or a little at all. Whatever is happening is perfect for you. There's no need to effort. Just sensing the already happening sensations within and around the right side or right 
hemisphere of the energetic body. The whole right side from scalp and hair all the way down to the tips of the toes. And then once again letting your attention migrate over to the left side of the body. You might imagine a tension sensation dropping away from the right side and saturating the left side of the body. And once again, you might imagine or welcome the electromagnetic field of the body spherical in nature. You might feel or imagine sensing the whole left side of the body and the whole left hemisphere of the energetic magnetic field of the body. Just imagining and sensing the already happening sensations from scalp and hair of the left side body all the way down to the left toes and sensing out into the space around the left side of the body. Whole left side of the body. And now, welcoming both sides of the body and both hemispheres of the body simultaneously. Could you feel or imagine equally distributing attention and awareness through both sides of the body, both hemispheres of the magnetic field of the body. Just sensing and maybe imagining out into the space around you or sensing out into that space around you. Bringing all of your attention now to the center of the forehead. Letting all of your attention condense at the center of the forehead. And begin to welcome also the darkness beyond your eyelids. Sensing into that space beyond your eyelids. Could you begin to welcome or imagine the following images within your mind's eye? within your imagination. A clear diamond prism refracting rainbow light in all directions. A clear diamond prism, rainbow light sparkling all around. A brilliant green and blue peacock, iridescent feathers of the peacock, 
a white lotus floating in serene, calm waters. A white lotus. A black swan. A beautiful black swan gracefully floating through the water. A magnificent butterfly. A beautiful butterfly landing on sweet, fragrant flowers. A rainbow all the way across the sky. A rainbow spanning the whole sky. A wise owl in the night sky, swift and silent. A wise owl soaring through the night sky. Shooting stars on the backdrop of the Milky Way. Sensing out into the galaxy. Shooting stars soaring across the sky on the backdrop of the galaxy. Sensing out into the galaxy and beyond. Floating peacefully surrounded by all of the galaxies in the universe. Floating peacefully surrounded by billions of galaxies. Traveling through space all around you. Sensing the vastness of the intelligence and diversity of galaxies, stars, planets, the intelligence of life infusing all that there is, flowing through you and all around you. Allowing yourself to float here in the calmness weightless tranquility and quietude of space As you float here, could you welcome your sankalpa by stating it or feeling it, infusing all that you are and all that there is?
and imagine yourself floating back down to planet Earth. Your body gently resting down into your relaxation, feeling the support of the Earth beneath your body, feeling the rhythm of your breath. You might imagine a thousand petal lotus at the crown of your head, breathing in through the crown all the way down to your root. Exhale through the mouth. Let's do that two more times in through the crown down to the root, exhale through an open mouth, and one more time like this, in through the crown, releasing, taking a moment here to notice how you feel, to Acknowledge the journey, the experience that you've been on here in your relaxation. And you might welcome any of the benefits of this particular practice for you today. As if you could sort of bask in the light of those benefits that you've created for yourself. And then, when you're ready, begin to slowly awaken your body with some small movements. Maybe moving the tongue around in the mouth or wiggling the fingers, the toes. You might nod your head or take a full body stretch. You might hug knees into your chest or rock your knees from side to side. Or roll to one side, just whatever feels intuitively right for you. Take as much time as you need to transition from this practice. You might lay on your side for several moments, just sort of grounding and integrating back into your waking life. And thank you so much for joining me today. Again, my name is Ali and this particular yoga nidra practice was part of a seven day yoga and yoga nidra immersion with myself and some of the other staff at the school of living yoga so if you'd like to participate in that at your own pace i will link the playlist here in the comments and in the description as well as at the end of this video if you're participating in the seven day immersion, please stick around and leave me a comment when you feel ready. I would absolutely love to hear from you. And if you are participating in real time when we are uh, releasing this immersion, then you might be excited about winning a prize that we're giving away. So you can learn more about that if you are um, interested by checking out our immersion. If you'd like to learn more about yoga, yoga nidra, restorative yoga, please check out my website. We are currently, at the time of this recording, going to be starting our Embodied Wisdom 200-hour online teacher training in about a month's time. So we're getting lots of applications right now in the moment, and it's a very, very exciting time to see this Sangha, this global community forming from around the world to learn and dive into all of the deeper teachings of yoga, yoga philosophy, and all of the wisdom that comes from this ancient tradition. We're so excited to dive into this path together, and you can learn more about that on my website, alibuthray.com. 
If you're participating in our immersion, you might let me know that you made it to the end of this immersion and the end of this video by sharing uh, one of the qualities of the crown chakra in your comment below. The crown uh, chakra really is full of beautiful symbology, include, including divine consciousness and pure consciousness, liberation, trust, and of course has the symbol of the thousand petaled lotus, or the diamond, and it invites us to really trust ourselves and trust in the intelligence of life itself. That intelligence that infuses all life in its interconnectivity. If you have completed the entire immersion with us, you might let me know as well in the comments below, how do you feel after the seven days of yoga and yoga nidra? What has the effect of participating in this immersion been for you? We would absolutely love, love, love to hear more about that and also where you're from. It's so exciting. There's been thousands of people participating from all over the world, and it's been such an honor to be your guides in this past seven days. So I hope that you had a beautiful practice today, and I can't wait to connect with you further. If you have any questions about our upcoming 200 hour, please just leave me a comment below. And of course, I will share with you all of the links and resources from the past seven days as well. Thank you so much for joining me and us if you're in the immersion with the School of Living Yoga this week. And I feel very grateful and honored to have been your guide. May you be peaceful, may you be happy, may you be healthy, and may you be free. Namaste.